Well, today is what some call the Christmas of baseball. It's Reds opening day. It's an all day affair chock full of celebrations all leading up to the big game. Living Dayton's Eliza Mahachek is live at Great American Ballpark with some of the details. If you plan to visit the stadium for today's game. Good morning, Liza. That's right, Kelly. There are countless festivities going on all throughout the Queen City celebrating the Cincinnati Reds, and it's all leading up to the star of the show, the 410 baseball game. And now, while it might not be packed right now, there are going to be flocks of people lining the stadium trying to get in. And now some of us may want to score a home run with a stadium seat for opening day. But there's some things you need to look out for if you're still needing to buy tickets. The BBB says to purchase from the venue whenever possible. If you plan to buy tickets online, only buy from trusted vendors. You can check those on the BBB's website. Also, know your refund policy. Use a credit card so you have some protection if something goes wrong because you you don't want to use cash because there's no paper trail and you'll likely never see that money again. John North with the BBB says it's important to, to know the difference between a professional ticket broker like Ticketmaster, a ticket scalper who's going to upcharge you on your tickets, and a scammer. Really the sad part is that you can't trust anyone and you have to verify. The best way to do it is go through legitimate sources that uh, are actually licensed brokers. John says that if you plan on buying tickets from people at the stadium, there's no guarantee that that ticket is actually real and if you'll get your money back at all. Now, if you are unsure about your tickets, whether or not they are real, you can go ahead and call the venues will call. They can help identify whether or not they're real or fake. At Great American Ballpark, I'm Liza Mahachek, 2 News.